Hello guys, welcome to this tutorial on Ubuntu on a cool theme meant for Docky and Ubuntu for the GNOME 2. Uh, maybe in the third GNOME this won't be accessible, but uh, this is f for now. Just get this link which I'll post it in the description. It's it's called Fan Fanza Gnome Icon Theme. Basically just go to the website, I'll post it, I'll provide it in the description, click on download file and save it to your downloads. Open up your downloads folder in Ubuntu and you should find a folder that's a zip file that says Faenza icons and whatever that's typed onto it. Basically right click on it and click on extract here. You should find a folder that says the exact same name. Double click on it and you should see something that says install basically this one to just to, for precaution so you won't have issues right click on it click on properties click on the permissions tab and check by the box that says allow executing file as program after that's done double click on the file click on run in terminal once the terminal pops up basically just press Y on the keyboard for yes and then after that this menu should pop up um, type U for Ubuntu so you can have your distribute logo you use which is this one up here on the top left as you notice press enter and then uh, click on D for distributor logo just to keep it a uh, premium of your Ubuntu operating system and then press Y well this is popping up for me because I already have it installed but this part shouldn't pop up just press enter after uh, your no main menu now this is the last part basically just press Y on the keyboard press enter it should be done. Right click on an empty spot on your desktop, click on change desktop background, click on the theme tab within the parents preferences, and then click on customize button. Then you should see the icons tab, click on that, and you should see Faenza icons. You click on that and your icons shall be changed also for Docky. Um, the downside is that the three here don't work for some reason. I think it does. Oh yes it does. It just shows an empty icon. You just click on it it changes it to make it darker or lighter for the panel up here just the downside it doesn't have it for uh, the theme of the distributor logo up here but the dark one it gives it a brighter but I suggest going to the original which is this which gives it the icon theme up there that's basically it I'll provide it in the description follow each step and you shall be good thanks for watching and goodbye